I love the song, <laughs> the Prince song. Welcome back to Valley View Live. Bob Tordy is our special guest host today. So tell us about the work that you do with the NSPCA. Uh, it's it's uh, <coughs> excuse me, a cause very near and dear to our heart. Um, we Our daughters were adopted. Oh, okay. So yeah. we thought, you know, we're definitely going to adopt a, uh, a pet. So we started with a little dog. His name was Maserati. Oh, neat. And then my youngest wanted a cat. So we got the cat, and we named the cat Dodge. <laughs> <laughs> and like, well, it's a theme. theme. Yeah, a theme. and then my wife said, I just want one more Yorkie before I leave this planet. So now we have Bentley. Bentley awesome. Maserati Dodge. Bentley. Yeah. That's neat. awesome. And we got them all at six weeks old, and they're just the best of friends. And we're convinced that they don't even know that they're dogs and cats. Because yeah. they sleep together, play together, just... Just it's so much joy in the house. And how are your girls? They're good. Yeah, they, I, I, I told them I was going to be on here today, and my youngest says, who Chloe's just awesome and unedited, she goes, yeah, Dad, you were good, but you needed to talk more about us. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Fantastic. Okay. So Faith talk and Chloe, more about go them. clean your room. There you go. <laughs> All okay, so what, how old are they, and what's it like? In the, this sounds like a really full household. It is, yeah. They're 11 and 13, and then my son lives with us, who's uh, 27, just turned 27. Okay. Um, so, yeah, we've got a, we've got a so big, So you've got busy, a preteen. Mm -hmm. I do. How's do that going for you? And they're both you? girls. Yes. <laughs> do any of them aspire to be an actor or singer? Or no. My youngest is very tech savvy. You know, she literally broke in everything we own because okay. she wanted to see how it works. Okay. And then try and put it back together. So, in my shop, I, I, I have a three-car garage. In the shop, we have a whole bin. We go buy old electronics. Oh. And we take it apart. Let's see how it made it work. And then we try and make something out of it. Oh, that's oh, awesome. So that's a lot of fun. My, yeah. uh, my oldest, uh, big volleyball player, Faith. And um, she kind of got the bug in her and okay. stuff, a little mm -hmm. bit. My son is like, <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> I've seen all those days you right. sat at home yeah. watching the soaps. <laughs> right. <clears throat> well, yeah, because you had a whole other life before you came, came oh, to yeah. Las Vegas Star. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I mean, I've, I've been doing this. This is my 40th year. Wow. Mm -hmm. Tell us about some of the years. roles that you played in some yeah. of your favorites. Um, that Thing You Do was one of my favorite ones with Tom Hanks. I oh, played I love that movie. Mr. And Downtown. the Nickelodeon yes. one. Uh, the, yeah, Sweet Life of Zack and Cody. Mm -hmm. um, and it's funny because our five friends of ours were just in town, R5, Ellington Ratliff, oh, yeah, is the drummer show. for R5. Wow. I changed his diaper. His wow. Oh my goodness. His parents are, not yesterday. Well, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Boy's 21. I mean, right. that would just well, be yeah, odd. <laughs> awkward. Um, no, we've been friends with their parents uh, forever, and oh. we used to sing in a 50s do up uh, group called uh, The Knights. And um, so they were in town. So we were at the Venetian where my show was, and he was at the Venetian, so I was holding his flyer, and he was holding my flyer. Oh, and cool. And That's the, love. The yeah. The social media just blew up. <laughs> you guys are getting ready to blow up at the Rio. Tell us about the change. Yes, the Rio. All wait, I have to say this right. The okay. Rio All Suites Hotel. Two buffets. Yeah, yeah. two buffets. Two buffets. Hello. Yeah. Two buffets, and uh, uh, yeah, it's it's going to be great. We're really looking forward to it. I think it's a perfect fit. Caesars has now jumped on board with us because it's a it's a Caesars property. Um, I think the show is going to be here for quite a while. Do you know yeah. what the, your schedule will be? Uh, it's uh, seven days a week. Wow. So seven Ooh, days a week. Time. Yeah. <laughs> the show's now at 7.30. Okay. I for us like old that. folk, we need to get I home. was like, is that considered That's a dinner show? 7.30? Yeah. 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 I guess. Yeah. 7.30. I mean, they all know, you know, every property is different. Mm -hmm. It's like we, we early on with Rock of Ages, we tried a 10 o'clock show. The club's own 10 o'clock. Yeah. You know, you can't do anything at 10 o'clock in this town. Okay. So um, do you have anything weird that you do? You know, you're, you're an artist. Mm -hmm. Years of doing it. Is there, is there a weird ritual? Is there something you do that, that gets you ready? For the show? For that, yeah, the show or a role that you might be playing? Um, it, it really depends. I mean, Rock of Ages have been doing it for now three years. Okay. It's, it's just put the mic on and just be funny. Just funny, okay. Um, but there are times, I have to say, you know, right. we've all done it. Be on stage and you're, you're like, this happened the other night. This is our last show. And I walk in and I go, and I play this German character. And okay. I say, um, uh, I will come by your office tomorrow. Oh. Oh, no. And then I just left. Okay. <laughs> and there was a lot more to be said. Right. You know, I yeah. was done. I uh -huh. finished. I was done. I call those brain farts. Yeah. yeah. I don't know if that's yeah. proper or not, yeah. but when your yeah. brain just says, yeah. I'm going to stop, I'm going to yeah. release that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the more physical shows that I do now that I'm older, I definitely have learned that I have to stretch more. Okay. Those, those days of just going out there and doing it are gone. Right. Um, but other than that, and vocally, uh, you know, I've been very blessed, knock wood. You know, yeah. I haven't had any issues and just go awesome. out there and Did you sing. warm up? No. 
Oh, so you're a natural. No, I take four Advil and a Red Bull. <laughs> <laughs> and then I'm and good there to go. you go. Yeah. Right. Yeah. How neat. How neat. <laughs> so what do you what are you expecting moving forward at the Rio? I mean, what wh how do you think the crowd might change? It's I think I think the Rio is our crowd. Mm -hmm. oh, I nice. think you know that's my generation. You know, all of us who were of legal drinking age on the Sunset Strip when the show you know yeah. took place. Okay. Um, it's off the Strip, which I think is also going to help because, like I said before, we have a big following of locals mm -hmm. who want to come to town but don't want to go on the Strip. Right. So Rio is perfect for us. It's a smaller venue. Okay. So more intimate. More I intimate. Very old club-like. There's booths. There's tables down front. And yeah. for people you know. who haven't seen it, the plot is this girl goes... Boy meets girl. Uh, she she comes from Paola, Kansas, and mm -hmm. meets this boy at this uh, the Bourbon Room, which is the bar mm -hmm. that it's based around. Um, and it's a love story, and I'm there to basically tear the bar down and turn it into condos. Mm. And the big rock star. It was kind of the story was basically loose on Brett Michaels. The mm -hmm. big rock star comes back where he got his start to try and raise money to. And then all the craziness ensues. And I love that. Yeah. It's a lot, a lot of fun. The show's a lot of fun. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. People just singing along and yeah, partying. That's, oh, that's it. the best part. Yeah. The music yeah. is incredible. Yeah. What are yeah. some of your favorite numbers? Everything I sing. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, yeah. as it should be. I didn't know that there was any other numbers in the show besides exactly. mine. And then, with as amazing as your life and career is, and continues to be, is there one thing? Is there a special thing that you haven't done yet that you want to do? No, my my goal is to go. I was Tony nominated. Yes. Uh, blessed to be Tony nominated. So my goal is before to go back and win the Tony. Okay nice. then. Yeah, so yes. Let's yeah. do that. So Can we campaign for that? Yeah. Yeah. Filthy Rich and yeah. Rio. In okay. And I love it. I think he's going to do it. Yeah. <laughs> Absolutely. Do you guys want to get into some bargains? Yes. 